Одна минута. We are now at T minus 30 seconds and counting. T minus 20 seconds. Everything's looking good. And T minus 10 seconds. T minus 5, 4, 3, 2, one, and we have liftoff of an ILS proton rocket from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan with a direct TV-12 communication satellite on board. No matter how many times you see it, it's, it's always an awesome sight to, to see the proton liftoff. Yeah, looks like we're back. We're back looking at the launch pad. Uh, must have been enough cloud cover to where we have a, a difficulty with the visual looking down range of the rocket. At about 10 seconds after liftoff, the rocket does a roll maneuver and will soon experience maximum dynamic pressure, or max-Q. Max-Q is the maximum aerodynamic load on the vehicle. It corresponds to back about Mach 1.5 and occurs at 1 minute, 2 seconds after liftoff. And we are right now going through the point, max Q. Everything seems to be proceeding nominally as the vehicle heads in an easterly direction with a flight azimuth of about 61.25 degrees. And back on your video, you see a good shot of the launch vehicle heading downrange. We are coming up on the first stage's separation from the second stage. Seasoned viewers will know that we typically get a visual indication of the separation before we get the telemetry indication. We are at uh, L plus two minutes now, so we should have just uh, had the stage one, two. Okay, we have a visual indication there of the stage one, two separation. Waiting for the official confirmation of uh, telemetry data coming from Baikonur. I uh, just did receive confirmation of a good separation from the, uh, of the first stage from the second stage. The second stage engines actually ignite while still attached to the first stage, and the exhaust from those engines escapes through the open grid work between those stages. Looks like we have a signal of a uh, good signal of ignition on all four second stage engines. The next key milestone uh, for the mission will be stage 2-3 separation at L plus 5 minutes and 25 seconds. 23 seconds later, the payload fairing will jettison. All right. Beautiful, Russ. And now that the rocket is heading downrange, let's take a moment to meet some of the key mission team members in Baikonur who worked on this launch. Leonid Borisov is the program director for Krunichev. He has a long history with the Proton program. Today, on the 25th of December 2009, on the day of the 